and this is another tech talk tech stack tip Tuesday for you uh, this one I'm going to be talking real quick it's just about a quick zoom tip uh, that I have recently implemented that I find to be very helpful um, one is hiding your self view on zoom and the reason why I would do that is I found myself recently uh, not recently all the time is I always look at myself when I'm on a zoom call it's distracting it uh, helps you not to focus you're always you know looking at yourself and saying what am I doing am I standing weird anyways I was reading an article recently about zoom fatigue and one of the reasons why zoom fatigue is is whenever we're conversing with someone virtually we are looking at ourselves and that's more exhausting whereas in the real world when you're having a real conversation with a real human being you're looking at them and so I'm gonna show you just a real quick tip here today on how to do that so here I am in a zoom call with uh, my rubber ducky sitting next to me here in my office so it's a super easy trick you just go here to your zoom call and you hit hide self view so go here hide self view and what I do is I actually minimize this um, and I bring it up to the top of my desktop screen here and the reason why is right above where my uh, desktop screen is my is where my camera is. I have a, a Logitech Brio camera, and I put it right above there. So that way, when I'm looking at it, I'm looking at the video. It looks like I'm looking directly at you instead of looking down or looking at myself. Like if I look down at myself right now, in my Loom video, I'm looking down. But if I'm looking at the ducky, because I have it set higher, it looks like I'm looking at you. So, quick tip: help maybe engage people a little bit better, help you be less distracted. Have a great day, people.